Ah, shit, my fan's on. Oh, rip. <laughs> yeah, I realized in the last episode, uh, or the last couple episodes, my fan was qu So, I'm going to bear with it and keep my fan off. Ish, maybe. Depends how hot it gets. It's relatively early in the morning. I need something... Oh, shit, I'm real thirsty. I need something low maintenance to record. Because it's early, and I'm tired. Oh, why are you recording when you're so tired? I don't know. I just am. Life continues to life at me. Repair powder? I always need that. <laughs> Forgot about the hell pockles and the unicycles. Jesus! Ugh. Right. The mowers. Fucking moon diggers. I've been told that this girl gets a uh, slingshot named Steve at one point that can talk. I don't know if I believe that. I'm choosing not to. Because that sounds kind of amazing. And I resent the person who told me that. You know who you are. Because that's a spoiler. An awesome spoiler, if true. But again, I don't believe it. That sounds like a Dark Cloud 2 thing, if you ask me. More of a Shelbyville idea, if you, if you understand the references I'm making. Which, the person who spoiled it for me does not get that reference. I don't care if they do get that reference. They don't get it. It's not a reference for them to get. At least there's a pool of water here. Everybody heals up. Especially my butt. There we go. Glorious. That tasty, tasty water. And crickets, or bassin, or whatever that was. Ugh. Fucking moon diggers. Hate you so much. They are the worst. I had truly hoped we were done with those guys. I'm glad nobody said, don't worry. There will be more when you get to the moon. Because I wouldn't have believed them if they had on him to be here. I already got the stupid fucking crank handle and the gunpowder. There's no treasure. There's no Steve's here either. What the hell? What? Why are there no Steve's? That's weird to me, because... I swear it said there were Steve's, and I clearly got the fucking gem that shows me where everything is. Brad, okay. Just saw that dot on the map and was curious. I can swear there were Steve's on the map, is the thing. Did I pick the wrong floor? I can believe I totally picked the wrong floor. What floor am I on? Ah, it's not gonna say. I was fucking around with my control, or er, accidentally. S no, I hit the up button to pick floor one at some point. But the lack of Steve's is concerning. Cannot be used now. What? Oh, can be used now. <laughs> I don't know why I read cannot. Probably said cannon can be used now. I'm gonna leave it temporarily and see what the hell's up. Because I swear it said there were Steves on that floor and there were no Steves. Pissing me off. I like how it launches me and then I pick my destination. 
Seems like something I would want to have planned out beforehand, you know? Just saying. Yeah, there's totally Steve's there. But, like, I must have accidentally... Yeah, I must have picked one of those floors by mistake. Well, whatever, off to floor six. That was embarrassing. was most embarrassing. There's the cannon. Rock monster. Oh no, it's wolves. You guys are easy to fight. I remember you. White Fang. Cheese acquired. Yay, cheese. Always use more cheese. The fuck? Bravely launch. Alright. I confess, I don't know what that is. It's like a springboard from gymnastics. Hey, gunpowder. Can I see what a bravely launch is? Yeah. So now it makes you jump and makes you brave and want to jump. I mean, I guess so. Okay. Mammoth tusks. Can't wait till we get people. That's what I want to see. Damn. Turtle shell. That's a Reuben weapon, that is. You appreciably better than that there, hammer boy. Uh, no. <laughs> it is really not. Still, just... Is it better in any way? No. Not really. If and when that last judgment ever gets to plus five, I'm equipping it to my other last judgment. Just so I have the greatest hammer of all time. Anyways. Tut tut train outside. Can't you see I'm recording? Auto repair powder used. Shit. Well, note to self pick up auto repair powder. I hadn't realized my sun sword was that low. More mammoth tusks. How are there moon mammoths? That's what I want to know. Where's the rich origin lore for that? One of you a crank? I don't want to fight the fish people. No! Because they suck. Oh, hey, the fancy map. I adjust my headphones, because all of a sudden my head's itchy. Yeah, for God's sakes. I'm not fighting your stupid fish. Don't lure me into that. Space Gaions. Alright, maybe I will fight your stupid fish if you're going to be an asshole. But only in the event that you're an asshole. Which you are. Has been firmly established. Can I point out how much of an asshole these guys are? Oh wait, I think I have already. Use stand-in powder. Well, I can't use Noki. Suppose I have any revival powder, paste or whatever it is. No, nah, doesn't look like it. Snack on that cheese, and then have some bread. It's clogging up the inventory. All because I wanted this item. Better be worth it. Yep, that's worth it. <laughs> Need that item. Oh, good. I hope something fun's waiting for me on the other side of the bridge. But it's candy and presents, that's what I hope. Hey, 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 hey. 
So, a werewolf on the moon. Is it, like, stuck being a werewolf forever? Because, like, werewolf comes out when the moon's full. I accept that, sure. But, like, on the moon? First of all, you're only ever seeing, like, half the moon when the moon is full. The other half's, you know, obscured from view, obviously. Finger! If you say so. So, if a werewolf, werewolf is on the moon, it has to be a werewolf all the time, right? There's no... I don't have treasure key. There's no escaping that. Or is it a full Earth that they need to see? I don't know, it was poison. Eh, well. Yeah. That's a terrible weapon. I already have that. A couple times over. Eh, not worth it. Nice. Ah! Don't care about any of you. I'm just here to get Steve's and then shoot myself out of a cannon back home. And avoid any Gions I see. Gions. I don't care. Or no. So yeah, I'm pretty sure a werewolf on the moon would just kind of have to constantly be a werewolf. And the thing is, we're taught that the only thing that can kill werewolves is silver, right? So, would the oxygen deprivation not matter? Also, if a werewolf is on a rocket ship, in dude form, he's in the wear form, eagle feather, the wear part of the wolf, which means man, he's still man, and he's on a rocket ship on an expedition to the moon, how close does he have to be to the moon before it's decided that's full enough and he just automatically becomes a werewolf? I want to see answers to these, and more, in the comment section below. Cannon can now be used, yeah. Not cannot now be used. Think of other stupid questions. Uh... Vampire would have to stay exclusively on the dark side of the moon. Who would win in a fight? A moon vampire or a moon werewolf? Because, keep in mind, you know, the moon vampire has to stay on the dark side. The werewolf can go wherever he wants. Furthermore, while neither of them should be killed by oxygen deprivation, uh, it should be noted that the vampire can turn to a bat, which is less helpful in a reduced gravity environment, whereas the werewolf can now jump higher. Of course, the werewolf doesn't have the same, you know, weight advantage over the vampire that he would on, here on our Earth gravity. Anyways, <laughs> enough thought-provoking questions. It's time to configure some shit. Okay, let's see. Uh, what haven't I set up? Oh, okay, those are the ones that are complete. I get it. Yep, still don't have that. You can go there. And you... Can go there. You can go there. Yeah, it's a character. But that's, I think... Yeah, it's the shoulders. Yep. Finish that part. And that's apparently all I can do. Alright. How's that shoulder looking? Eh, about the same, honestly. Clearly making a giant robot. Anyone who says otherwise is a liar. And they know they're a liar, too. They know what they did. It's a liar. A lying liar with the lies they tell.
So if your answer to that werewolf vampire question was in fact a vampire, what if the werewolf built a house and the vampire had to like be invited in and the werewolf knew the only other person on the moon was the vampire? Like, I think at that point he would in fact have the advantage. Further question, uh, does a search warrant count as an invitation to the home? Like, if a vampire shows up to your house with a search warrant, is he now allowed to enter, or do you still have to invite him in? Because legally speaking, he can enter. You know, we have no problems in the legal sense. I can't remember which one's the store. And depending on how you answered, two said uh, warrant question what if I launch the vampire from a trebuchet with a warrant stapled to his head at your wide open front door I want both yes and no responses to that because if the answer is yes then you know the guy's just flying in through your front door if the answer is no, he can't enter with this enter with the search warrant. What's going to happen if I just launch him at your front door with a trebuchet? Is he going to die on impact, crushed against the door that isn't there, or will he simply enter and have to honorably kill himself because he broke vampire code? You gotta have vampire codes. You know, otherwise, just there's chaos in the vampire community, and, and we can't have that. I mean... Do I want to get rid of that? I don't think I do. I feel like this is going to come in handy later. Bravely launch. I feel like I will need that. Don't know why, but I feel like I do. Can I prattle on more about the intricacies of supernatural beings living on the moon? Hmm. I can't think of another one. There's mummies, but, you know, they're not really a moon-type creature. I went with werewolves and vampires because they sort of rely on just one. Oh, this must be like a boss room. They, they rely on, you know, the moon and the night, respectively. You don't see them during the day. That's the general rule. Wow, and this four using weapons reduces abs. Cannot be changed either. Well, that's annoying. Why is there only one Steve? That's what I want to know. Uh, but I can change characters. Ruben, you're not doing much with your abs. Vicious cycle. He's just fast enough to block my hammer. Oh my god, what is that? Vulcan? That's a demon, that's what that is. It's a moon demon. If werewolves and moon vampires saw that shit, they'd get the fuck off the moon. That guy owns the moon now. Because, I mean, in order to like effectively fight that thing, werewolf or vampire, they have to bite it. Alright, and I'm not sinking my teeth anywhere near that thing. Hey, I know where the Steve is now. Still need to find the gunpowder, unfortunately. Once I find it, though, I'm not touching another dude. I was really hoping it was there. 